obviously it was a fantastic uh, game for us. We've been rebuilding this program for several years and uh, to move on to Sweet 16 is awesome. Uh, just want to say Portland is a fantastic team. They play great soccer. I thought that the way they played tonight has scared me to death. And they're passing their ability to combine and get in and the way they've been coached by Garrett. And they, it's a great team, but tonight I felt like we defended well throughout the match and we found special moments to put great chances away. Tim, just talk about early on. Obviously, they were focused on you, but you were able to uh, find open people around you when they collapsed on you. Talk about that a little bit. Yeah, it was hard. There was a couple people on me, but our team did well. Like We worked together like always and to get players and more players around the ball to help each other out, so it worked well. Benders are kind of getting frustrated. You're getting kind of worn out playing zero in the course of the game. Um, sometimes you can sense it, but Portland did a good job. They, you know, the defenders were strong, so it was a battle the whole game. Um, you know, I think I'm just kind of hitting my stride now. i finally getting to get minutes back on the field, and to be honest, when you have a team around me like I do, uh, they make it easy for you to score goals because they just they put it right there for you. And all you got to do is put it back in the net. Much different than last game where you guys fell behind early. To come out and get that early goal, what does that do for the team and team count? I mean, that just gives you so much confidence from the get-go. Um, you know, we were really looking forward to coming and playing Portland because they're a great soccer playing team, so we knew it was going to be a good game right from the get-go. Um, and we just came out strong and hard, and we knew we had to get the first. When we get the first, got to get the second. Um, and we just knew that that, that one before our half was a really important goal, um, and that gives a lot of confidence going into the locker room. Pleased that we scored the first goal, uh, but looking I mean I felt like our scheme was very good you know but they were still throwing the kitchen sink at us like both fullbacks were like wingers you know it's like Barcelona and our our young players weren't understanding how to defend that and so uh, then when the second goal went in right before half I'm like you know because I thought they had some great chances in the first half where they got slipped through in the box. I thought they could have converted them. The one great save from Haley, she kept that one out right after the goal. You know, I thought we were very fortunate to be up 2-0 at halftime. Uh, Coach, you kind of talk about seniors and veterans taking over at this part in the year. You had two goals from seniors today and Kem, you know, another one and yeah. shut out from your senior in goal. Just kind of talk about the, the veterans stepping yeah. up at this time of year. I mean, it's the way you hope things go, is that your seniors at the end of the year, it's been a great year for them, and that they're carrying it. And that's happened today. Haley made the great save to keep us one up. Uh, Claire scored the early goal off a great assist from Kim. Emily sticks one in 30, 40 seconds. I'm just hoping we can kill the half without giving up a goal. And she sticks one in. Uh, so, you know, those, those are our three seniors and for them to be moving on to Sweet 16 after a five-year rebuilding process at Michigan is just, it's just fabulous. They're, they're, they're just over the moon right now.